Thanks, Rob. For over 80 years, the Historical Association of Catawba County has preserved the objects, stories, and places that matter most to the people of Catawba. I'm here today at one of four sites at the Harper House. Let's see what we can find out. I'm Sydney. I am the lead curator with the Historical Association of Catawba County. And my name is Lillian Underwood, and I'm the assistant curator. Of course, and tell me about what the Harper House is. Well, the Harper House was created in 1887, and it's a wonderful example of the Queen Anne styling, which is from the Victorian era. Um, here we have a lot of things that are time period appropriate, um, beautiful antiques and artifacts from the period, and um, tours are open, so come in and see us. It's only $10 a person. What do you hope the community takes away from visiting the Harper House? We hope that when the community comes to visit the Harper House, as with all of our historic properties, that they um, learn about the history of Catawba County, how people lived and worked and enjoyed in the times past. Um, at the Harper House, we hope that people learn specifically about how people lived in the Victorian ages. Of course, and for each of you, what is your favorite part about the Harper House? Oh, my favorite part is the speakeasy, which is actually the third floor, the attic, and um, getting to learn more about Prohibition, and that era was really interesting for me. My favorite part of the Harper House is the ladies' parlor on the second floor. Um, from the outside of the house, it's that beautiful stained glass window you can see from the street. It's one of my favorite things about Victorian Queen Anne style architecture. Hello, I am Susan Mata and I am the site manager here at Harper House. We have a very special event coming up. It is called A Taste of Prohibition at Harper House. And it's called that and we're celebrating it because we have a speakeasy here in the Harper House. That, that gala will also incorporate our other sister property, the Lyerly House, across the parking lot. And it will also have vintage cars. We, we're going to have a dinner that is catered by Duke's Restaurant here in town. And then we will also um, have the band Euphoria, and we're going to be dancing the night away. Uh, we'll have a dance teacher that will teach us the Charleston dance as well. We're going to have um, a professional photographer. We've got so many extras for this event, it's too much to list. This event is happening to uh, celebrate the opening of a brand new exhibit that we have here. The exhibit is in the other house, the, Har the Larley house, and uh, in there we have a exhibit. It's called uh, uh, The Legacy of Moonshine and the Road to NASCAR. And that story is telling uh, all about all of those things. It's going to talk about prohibition. It's going to talk about the temperance movement. It's going to talk about the Ridge Runners and, uh, and of course, moonshining and leading into NASCAR. A true speakeasy hideaway here at the Harper House. For more information, go to catawbahistory.org. I'm Ariana Mack reporting for WHKY News. Back to you in the studio, Rob.